Missouri lawmakers back at the state house with lots of decisions to make this session. One piece of legislation involves legalizing sports betting. KSHB 41 News anchor Bryant Madrick explains how this bill aims to generate money for schools in Missouri. In Jeff City, lawmakers are back, and for Senator Tony Luchtemeyer, one priority is sports wagering. What we're seeing is educational tax dollars from Missouri citizens spilling over into our border states. And so what I want to make sure is we're keeping those educational dollars here in Missouri and making sure that we're supporting our schools and supporting our teachers. The Parkville lawmaker says under his bill, 10 to $20 million would go to Missouri schools. His legislation would bring Missouri in line with other states that legalize sports gaming. Kansas is one. It went live in September. I was there when Governor Laura Kelly placed the first bet. Others have followed, including Missouri's Mike Cravallo. I think it's way past time uh, to make it much more convenient for people in Missouri uh, instead of having to come all the way out here in Kansas. If you want to place a legal sports bet, you still have to come to Kansas. And since lawmakers gave it the okay, over $536 million has rolled in. And out of that, a little over a million dollars has gone to the state. Was it worth it? I think to a certain degree it was. That's and, uh, Kansas State Rep. Stephanie Clayton. She voted for sports gaming, but admits there's room for improvement. Some of the biggest changes that I would be most uh, used to entertaining would be maybe changing the attracting sports teams to Kansas fund. I don't find that particularly likely. And so some retooling to that and anything that would allow the state to keep more revenue that was generated from sports wagering. For now, Mike has to keep crossing the state line to place wagers. One Betty sure off Missouri legalizes sports gaming this year. They have to do it. They can't afford not to. We'll see. In Kansas City, I'm Bryant Madrick, KSHB 41 News.